I can't well, move. Oh! oh. oh. Holy! Oh my God. No! 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 Oh my God! <laughs> Give me the f out of here! Oh my fucking God! Oh no! 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 Oh no! I can't go any faster! Hell Divers 2 Rap by JT Music. Wow. I haven't watched a JT Music video in forever. As a matter of fact, hold on. Real quick, just a little traipse through our history. Let's look up JT Music and let's see when the last time was we reacted to... Uh, let's see. The last time I remember reacting to any video game music was when we were still at the mansion. Yeah. 2020? Mm -hmm. Holy fudge sickles. Doom Eternal rap. Yeah. I remember that one. That one was actually pretty good. Yeah. It has been a while since we've reacted to JT music. Huh. Kind of feel bad about that because I I like JT music. I've never really had anything bad to say about them. They like they make good music and they're consistent with the theme. That's something that you, you run into a lot on YouTube, is that they, they're, like, the theme is there, but then they abandon it after, like, the first verse or two. Because, I can't, I, okay, you want to know the worst uh, one of that? The worst one of that is uh, Purple Lamborghini from the Suicide Squad uh, movie. Did you ever see that? Okay. Because I never watched the movie. Okay, good. Well, that's good because you saved yourself like a bunch of headache. But there was a song. I just refused to watch Harley Quinn and not have the accent. And here's the hoping that Lady Gaga does it justice and actually does the accent. So as I said, anybody that was upset about Chris Pratt's Mario, but you weren't didn't have my back with Harley Quinn and the Suicide Squad, I don't want to fucking hear it. Well, Chris Pratt was <laughs> at least passable. I, I. He by no means is, like, the best part of that movie. I mean, of course, Jack Black. Everyone says Jack Black's the best part of the movie. But I think Charlie Day, really underrated as as Luigi. Mm. And can we all agree that the worst voice actor in the entire friggin' movie is Fred Armisen as Cranky Kong? Yeah. That is the worst casting. The worst. I mean, hell, I'll even forgive Seth Rogen because... I liked his performance. His performance was actually pretty damn good. It's definitely better than the Cranky Con. Ugh. Yeah. So, yeah, Helldivers 2 rap by JT Music to Liberty and Beyond. So, um, keeping with the theme of, of doing music that's themed around stuff, I remember a long time ago, we actually wanted to do a cyberpunk rap. You mm. remember? Yeah. I was I was helping like write lyrics for everything. Cause y'all did that phasmophobia rap that was actually pretty dope. Yeah, we did we did one for phasmophobia. It was a uh, whack ass phantoms. It was a parody of a uh, of uh, whap, whap yeah. from uh, Cardi B and Megan The Stallion, and uh, it was <laughs> it was pretty funny. Um, but then there was a but then we were wanting to do the cyberpunk rap, and then cyberpunk came out and it was just god awful. At least, at least on consoles. PC was alright. PC was, eh. Except for me, who was trying to play it on PC and couldn't even get past the damn prologue until they put out the first major update. Yeah, because Jackie just wasn't there, mm -hmm. right? I mean, you, you so I did all the side missions and everything, and I encountered a crap ton of bugs. Oh, and then oh. I got to the point where I was out of stuff to do besides advance the story, and it never would work. So I had well, to from to fix it with an update. Well, here's the thing. Now, now it's a pretty bitching game. Oh yeah, with the 2.0 update, it is it it is literally a different game. It's night and day, mm. and um, who knows? They even changed like the systems and stuff than the way like obviously, like the whole plot and everything is the same. And, but I mean, that was the only like really decent part of it when it first released was like the characters and the acting and the plot. Well, yeah. And plus, but everything know, else was lackluster, and everything else has pretty much been improved at this point. So. Mm -hmm. And 
here's and here's my thing about that is it it shows that that CD Projekt Red is willing to eat the like bad press and all that to fix to fix like their game. They basically did they basically did what No Man's Sky did. They basically did what Hello Games did with No Man's Sky. They kept grinding on it until they eventually got it and delivered the game that they were promising to everybody. And I feel like it is the game that it's, it was supposed to be. It's like minus like one or two things maybe. Like, yeah, it's mm. pretty close now. But all that being said, though, with the like the cyberpunk rap, I still remember my, the verse. I can still recite it one-to-one because I, I I wrote it and I was really happy with it because of just how, how much I put into it. But enough about my raps. Let's get into the raps of the amazing group JT Music. Also, this... as of this video, I finally actually got to play Helldivers 2. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I still they have. They announced that uh, Ghost of Tsushima was finally coming to PC in May, so I was like, well, I'm going to go <laughs> trade in my PS5 copy then. And yep. Everybody who's like, digital sucks, is immediately like, you're an idiot. And I'm like, I don't care. He <laughs> loves Ghost of Tsushima, and he wants it on PC. That, that's I don't the need thing. the PS5 copy because I'm never going to play it on there again. Like, why would I do that when I can have even higher settings on PC? Mm-hmm. It's like, is your PC better than a PS5? Yes. Yes, it is. it is. It is. There is no doubt about that. That's, you see, that's the thing. I built hit like, I purposefully, like, made it to where his would last him at least five to six years. Like, he would not have to upgrade anything for around five to six years. And so far, like... He hasn't had to, like you haven't really had to since we gave you the newest the most. I mean, it can still be even beefier, but it does what I need it to. So. Well, yeah, it's got a thirty seventy. I mean, that's the thing. Like, if the forty series goes down in price, man, I mean, we could see about getting you like a forty eighty. If you had a forty eighty, holy shit, that thing would be that thing would be a killer. I was still kind of looking at the um, what you call it. Dang it. Oh, the XTX? Yeah. Yeah, the Radeon XTX? Mm. Those, you're going to want to wait for the next round to come out because the eighty, the 8000 series is looking ridiculous. Mm. Uh, the, like the 8900 XTX, whenever it comes out, or the, co- the comparable card to the 7900 XTX. We'll see how that goes. I mean, if that's, I mean, if we can get you one like that, then that'd just be, that'd be huge. Plus, It'd be cheaper than the the NVIDIA variant because NVIDIA is just getting greedy at this point. NVIDIA NVIDIA is getting ridiculous, man. Anyway, enough of our bitching about the world of computer gaming. Let's get into Helldivers 2 rap by JT Music. Here we go. All super earthlings, give your full attention to this public service announcement. Here's a complaint may result in capital punishment. Join the Actually, uh, yeah, that's their salute. It's kind of <laughs> like the, you know, like, yeah, what was it? Yeah, it was that, it was that give your heart from Attack on Titan kind of thing. You know, they have their own salute, but it's, uh, da, 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 as far as I can da, tell, da, da. it just looks like this. Like, yeah, it's basically the up yours minus the kind of, yeah, <laughs> just like, what does that mean? You want to fist me? <laughs> well, I mean, it's true. Yeah. 
Dawn of Destruction is actually a name you could give your shit. Yeah, that's what, I think, that's what I'm thinking. It's probably what he named it. <laughs> like the timing of Indivisible as everyone ends up in pieces. <laughs> it gets decimated. This part goes hard. named her savior while I'm eradicating any trace of traitors. There's a lot more bark to these bugs and bite. The only program a robot to run is strike. Whoever said I'm from a country like a cult, I might. You'll never notice how progressively I thought the rides. I might be a space kid there, but I'm based as hell. I make the founding fathers of my super nation proud. Damn, that's a good, that's, dude, the lyrics in this are so good. <laughs> Powered by Meta PC. I wonder if that's what they captured all this footage on, is like PCs Probably. for Meta's PCs. Mm. That okay. Uh, if we ever get sponsored by a PC company in the future, I hope they give us like some uh, like a beastly machine that we can just be like show off. Like, dude, literally, if one did. I would have it like right here beside oh, yeah. me on camera at all times. Be like, oh, by the way, buy from these dudes. They are freaking amazing. I mean, look That's at this. That's the thing. thing is like, if you build your own PC, you can obviously make it look kind of like you want to, but it takes a lot yeah. of work. Oh, yeah. Um, and it's more expensive to buy pre built, but mm -hmm. a lot of the times they look baller. Like, yeah. Well, so the you one... definitely like want it on display if you do get one pre built like that. I think I might have shown it to you, but Jack from Achievement Hunter had one made inspired by Doom, and it is amazing. Uh, let's see. It's usually the extra money is going to make it look amazing on the outside as well. Let's see. It's just run really well, you know. Let's see. His personal PC. Yep. Uh, do, uh, it was a rig. Yeah, uh, GeForce Garage. Yeah, that... They basically, uh, him and his wife Katie, basically they uh, they got they got the ability to uh, get a rig update, and what they did with Jax is just amazing. Now, albeit this the the tech's a little bit outdated, but still, and and Katie's is pretty cool too. They gave her like a like a cutesy one. She's very much like a nature head and all that. But look at Jax, dude. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> it also looks like huge. It is. It's like gargantuan. Really big, well, it has yeah. two. It has two like full size graphics cards in it. Yeah, that's pretty dope. It's like inspired, clearly inspired by like Doom Guy's armor. You know. Yes, that's actually the point. Uh, and also the uh, also the fans uh, were custom made up front to have like the tri like that's on the door like the pat the tri pattern right there that's on the doors whenever you go through the doors. <laughs> and it's it's amazing. I, yeah. I mean, that kind of got off topic, but the rap was dope. Oh, sure. yeah, sorry. 
Sorry, we were talking about PC. See, this is how we, we go, we, guys. We forgot to give our thoughts on the rant. <laughs> yeah. We'll get... Okay. It's like, especially I, a couple of those segments, I was just like, yeah. yeah. Well, no, <laughs> like, here's the thing I'll say. Here's hard. the thing I'll say. We get distracted. And plus, we just got done with band practice, and my brain's already a little fried. So, here's what I will say about the rap. Damn good. Mm-hmm. Damn good. I mean, it kept the concept in mind. It basically played with the idea of just like, oh, the guy who's rapping literally just got blown the fuck up. Here's the next dude, and he's rapping too. He's just like, hey, man, sorry, I'll pick up where you left off. And and I love that. And gosh, it, it and some of the rhymes in this went hard as hell, and I, and I love it. I just think I, love that that. I need to watch it again because it's like I picked up on a couple jokes that I think were probably a little subtle. You know, oh, like, yeah. I wonder how many I missed. Probably a lot. <laughs> oh well, yeah. I mean, that's the thing. But it, it JT is JT music is layers upon layers of just like great, great, uh, like like just jokes within jokes on there. <clears throat> I would say them and Dan Bull are two of the best in terms mm-hmm. of like video game raps. I know that Dan Bull. I know uh, Dan Bull. Like probably my favorite by him is the Borderlands one because. The Borderlands Two one specifically because holy crap he goes he goes ham. Uh, my wolf or his wolf and side one's probably my favorite. Yeah, the wolf and side one's really good too. And everyone always talks about his Skyrim rap, especially the line great, because what's the point in just favorite. like you know what's the point in just punching a Nazi? Exactly. <laughs> I was just like that's a good line. Yeah, let's just. <laughs> oh God. So yeah. Killing Nazis. <laughs> so yeah, JT music, everybody. Um, also, it's weird, uh, I, when I say JT, like, the lead singer in our band is JT. Oh, yeah. And... Not the same JT. Not the same, band, but... but equally as awesome. I love, yeah, we, we love JT, and also, we love JT Music, and, uh, JT Music, uh, thank you for this. This was really, really good. I hope that, uh, I hope that, you know, everyone enjoyed, and I hope that you all enjoyed our thoughts on it, and... I guess that's going to do it. So, until next time, everyone, signing off, I am Nate. I am Nick. Y'all be good people. Take care. Peace.